Here in our department, we feel like we have put together a world-class program in mathematics education to prepare future middle and high school mathematics teachers. And now one of the biggest challenges we have is trying to make sure that every BYU student who thinks they might want to be a mathematics teacher has the opportunity to find out. It's really common in a lot of education degrees to have your content where you're basically a major, like a math major, and then take a course or two on teaching and then head out into the classroom. And so what's innovative about our department, I think, is that we have built up so many classes that are not about math and not about teaching, but are about teaching math specifically. The opportunity to spread things out and have a connection with our students and be able to see how they're able to take in pieces of the program as they go through it rather than just being thrown all of it at once is a great opportunity that I haven't seen at any other university. Our program is different than many because we've changed the structure of student teaching from what is typical or traditional to something that is more supportive of student learning. It really has three types of courses. You have your professional education courses that any teaching major has to take. But then the bulk of the program is mathematics content courses, um, which are your undergraduate mathematics classes, differential equations, calculus. And then students usually spend about two and a half to three years taking a really large number of math education courses, a sequence of five or six classes leading up to student teaching, plus a couple additional classes that just fit in in various places on technology, one on statistics for teaching. So that's the broad overview of the math education program. Some of the hallmarks of this program are that our students are paired in a classroom, so there isn't just a single student teacher, but two together. And what this does is it facilitates a lot of collaboration between those two student teachers and the cooperating teacher. It makes it so they never take on the full teacher load, but it allows them to plan lessons together and then teach them individually and watch each other teach the classes and then adjust and adapt based on what they're observing. And then we cluster them with student teachers at a neighboring school, and then they come and observe each other and give each other feedback. So basically it's more collaborative and mentor teachers love it as well because they really like being able to work with two student teachers and learn from both of them because the best mentor teachers that we have are ones who are still learning themselves, who are constantly trying to improve their craft. Something I love about this program specifically is the emphasis on student discovery and task-based learning. I've never had a teacher that teaches the way that they're teaching us to teach, helping the kids understand the concepts rather than just like formulas. And so it's been really helpful to me to watch them do that in the classroom and like explain how to do that because I've never had a teacher that has done that before for me. So when I finally got to practicum and could start to teach in that way, it was just so much more exciting to be able to watch the students discover the math. And so that has made the biggest difference in what I even thought my career would look like. Like what I initially thought it would be versus what I want it to be now is completely different since going through the program. One of the great things about being our own department of mathematics education is that we support each other in the various research projects that we work on. And the research that we're doing um, in math education is really devoted to trying to make the learning and teaching of mathematics more efficient and uh, more productive. I worked as a research assistant for two of the professors and as part of the research that we were doing, I was watching classroom videos and having the opportunity to work with them and discuss their research, I feel like I got like this really hyper-focused uh, experience where I was able to see all kinds of, of positives and negatives and learn from those and hopefully make my own teaching better because of it. We also have an MEA, which is the Mathematics Education Association for the students here that's related through NCTM. They have activities usually once a month that bring all the students together. Um, we'll have guest speakers come in. We'll have nights where we do just activities where they come in and play games. But just getting that community and developing it a community where when they go out to the schools they still have that connection with people and so they can contact their friends or colleagues 
and it's just kind of a continual thing that they're growing throughout the whole year. Each of these courses is built by our department to prepare students with the next thing that they should learn, the next thing they should learn. And so these carefully sequenced courses allow them to gradually develop these teaching skills while also going into the classroom and seeing real students at work in math classrooms. So that by the time they get to student teaching, they've had a lot of experience preparing for the moment they set foot in the classroom. They've written tasks, they've designed assessments, they've tried out assessments and interviewed students, they have taught many lessons to each other, and they've been doing this for, for a couple years at that point by the time they get to student teaching. There's just things that you can't learn in a classroom that you learn when you're teaching. So I learned how to connect with students, I learned how to respond to comments and how they think, I learned like classroom management, and that's been really helpful for me in making the decision to even get a master's and feeling like I can move forward in my career and be completely backed up by everyone that I interacted with here at BYU. One of the great things about being at BYU is that our students come from all over the United States and outside the United States as well. And many of them, after they graduate, go back and settle there. And so we feel like we're having an impact on the teaching and learning of mathematics, not just here at BYU, but around the world. I really like the idea of helping students see mathematics as not a list of rules that we have to follow or a bunch of algorithms that we have to memorize, but rather a way to understand and interpret and evaluate and make informed decisions about the world that they live in. And I, I want to impart that, that hope and that exploration uh, to those students. This year, we're gonna probably have over 30 students who graduate in math education who can go out and get teaching jobs. That's a huge number in comparison to other universities who are graduating two or three, maybe five per year. But I think what we're doing in our program is really giving our students the opportunity and the tools to try to transform the teaching of mathematics across the United States or even across the world, which eventually will influence the students and how they understand mathematics. Ooh.